Timothy has made huge losses since the roundworm infestation on his farm. Many of his animals came down with it, and because they couldn't arrest the situation early, the animals eventually died after the worms severely destroyed several of their organs. Now Mr. Timothy is in debt, and he does not know what to do as he couldn't sell the animals. They look emaciated, had respiratory issues, and couldn't eat due to indigestion and constipation. In our previous lesson, we discussed the life cycle of roundworms. In today's lesson, we want to review the economic importance of roundworms. In essence, what we want to know is how roundworms affect livestock. The effect of roundworms on livestock has a significant effect on the income of the farmer, just as we have seen in Mr. Timothy's case. This is because no one wants to buy worm-infested animals, and sometimes the animals even die. Roundworms reduce the growth of host animals and affect their yield and productivity. High infestation also affects the respiration of animals because like we discussed in our lesson on the life cycle of roundworms, roundworms travel through the lungs in livestock. Roundworms also cause indigestion and constipation in animals, which causes weight loss and emaciation in the animals. The loss of appetite and weakness they experience often contributes to the death of the animals. During the migration of roundworms through certain organs in the body, they often destroy many organs. With this, we have come to the end of our lesson on the economic importance of roundworms. In our next lesson, we'll be talking about how bullies can arrest the situation on the farm and control the roundworms. See you then.